I need that money. I really, really do. I need that money. I, I really need that money. Really need that money. I need that money. I really, really do. I need that money. I, I really need that money. Really need that money. Really that money. That money. <clears throat> What a heck of a day. I think a little bit for everyone. Yo, gameplay, <clears throat> reacting, food vlogging. This is the finale. And what I'm going to do right now is have a brownie that my wife made. Um, but I don't think that the frosting solidified yet. <laughs> Basically, it's a, it's a chocolate brownie with a peanut butter frosting and crushed nuts, crushed peanuts on top. And it, it looks good, smells great, but definitely the frosting is gooey. Like, you can tell it needs to be in the fridge more to solidify more. So, it's fine. Because what happened is, of course, she frosted it when it was out of the fr the oven. So, it's probably too warm to solidify yet. And it just hasn't sat in the uh, fridge long enough. But, flavor-wise, it's probably going to be good. It smells good. All right? So, this is my birthday cake this year. No cake this year. Uh, but instead, a brownie with some peanut butter. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. Okay. <laughs> That's whack. Thanks for giving a membership and it went to Toasty Ghost. Congrats, Toasty Ghost. Okay. Let's see. Punchy. The frosting. Didn't solidify, like I said. So it's very gooey frosting. It needs times to harden. If it hardens, it's going to be perfect. I've had brownies just like this before. The brownie part tastes amazing. It's nice. It's moist. It's chocolatey. But definitely the peanut butter frosting needs more time to cool. But it will. It's in the fridge right now. It's just a matter of time, I guess. If you think about it, we ate around 4.30-ish. So she only had three hours, and she probably made them. It probably took about like, like, like 15, 20 minutes to do the batter, probably half an hour to bake. So really, it hasn't even been in the fridge for two hours, and that's probably why. So anyway, but it tastes great. The peanut butter flavor is good. I like the crunchiness of nuts on top, and uh, it's fudgy. Nice and chocolatey fudgy. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> it's good. Personally, I really like nuts. I think they're tasty. So, it's my style of a cake with the crunchiness. Yeah, what's, what's wrong with paper plates? Anyone want to elaborate on that? Since now I see multiple people saying that in chat because you're idiots. You know, it's not like my wife didn't just completely make this from scratch in the kitchen, had to wash a ton of dishes because she did it, right? And maybe I want to avoid having her have to, to actually, like, like wash dishes because we don't have a, a working dishwasher that's been broken for years. You know, do a nice thing. Just use a paper plate and throw it out. Don't have to wash it. Oh, no, but, you know, paper plates on your birthday, right? That's a big deal. You're an idiot. <laughs> You're good. Of all the things in life to be worrying about, you're worrying about paper plates. You're, I mean, no brain, right? <laughs> exactly. Bring out the fine china to eat your birthday brownies on. It's such a big deal, right? <laughs> such a huge deal. So, what did you guys think of the marathon today? Since we're adjourning here, what was everyone's favorite part of the marathon? I'm curious. I want to hear what did you guys think was the best part?
Jade, welcome back. I'm coming from multiple brownies. <laughs> DJ Box Gaming is happy I read his super chats. Maximum Turbo says for me the podcast and the Street Fighter 6. Felix the Maid liked the reacting. Did I drink? Yeah, I had two drinks. Kiagag liked the podcast the most, then Street Fighter 6, then Hell Divers in that order. <clears throat> I say I like the reacting. Everyone just likes different things, see? But that's a good thing about a marathon like this is a little bit of something for everybody. Right? Like someone had said, the problem with me, with everyone saying they want more gaming, is that no one agrees on the games. <laughs> right? Like, oh, I want Phil to play more games, but what game? Well, one person wants an RPG, one person wants a fighting game, one person wants this. When I do a marathon, I get to do a little bit of everything. And because of that, it kind of appeases everyone. Which is a good thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you still talking about paper plates? Seriously. You really want to talk about paper plates? You're that stupid. Someone actually is still talking about paper plates in the chat. I mean, you want to be the most detail-oriented idiot. You, I'm sitting here at the end of my birthday marathon and being nice to people, asking, what did you like? Someone actually talk about paper plates again. <laughs> wow. <clears throat> What's my birthday wish? I don't have a birthday wish. I don't have, I never did that. I never said make a wish. I'm like, what am I wishing for? It's my birthday. I'm already having a celebration. What else am I wishing for? Right? Listen, I just got to spend the day with a cool audience, hanging out, doing a variety of things I like to do. Tons of support for the channel. This is going to help the channel long term in a huge way. But the amount of stuff that came in today, seriously, it's going to help a lot, which is awesome. Right? Um, now I'm going to upload and I get to spend time with my wife tonight. I get to actually leave here a little bit earlier than usual. So I get to spend some extra time with my wife. Right? What? And tomorrow I get to get up and do it all again. I get to do have another fun day with you guys. And, you know, what, what, what more could I want? You know? Right now I'm happy. <laughs> right now I'm happy. I'm not thinking about what else I want, what else I'm wishing for. Right? That's ridiculous. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You ate while I ate, Dr. Oink? Oh, yeah. I see a brownie is tasty. Mm. DZ had another haiku. He said, cheers to 42, delightful peanut brownies, chocolate flavors. Indeed. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Thank you for the birthday haiku, DC. Drunken Weasel, yes, I'm going to upload everything tonight. The only stuff that won't fully go live tonight is the reacting. Because I don't, I wanna, I don't want to flood... My throwback channel with too many videos. Already once a day there's a gameplay video. And I'll probably do one a day for the next few days. I don't want to go crazy and upload like three of those videos. Plus a new gameplay video. Then tomorrow we're going to have the Walking, Walking Dead stuff. So I'll space it out. Everything else though should go live today. I'll see today, tonight, and tomorrow. I will upload, of course. Yummy. There's some more shout-outs to do. I'll do them in a second when I finish my cake. Excuse me. My brownie. Mm. Mm. 
<laughs> okay. I can actually talk now. <laughs> I can actually talk. Um, so first of all, I received a six dollar tip. Oh, let's see. Happy birthday, Phil, from one Aries to another. I wish it would have been there for some of your birthday stream, but I just got home from work. I was working since 2 p.m. Eastern time. Hope it all went well. I'll take two tequila shots for you. Well, enjoy your tequila shots. Thank you for the $6 tip. I don't know who you are because you didn't give, leave your name. But I hope you had a good day at work as well, and thank you very much. I appreciate that. Let's see here. I got a $5 super chat from Spawn Killer. Happy birthday. Crazy how when you started YouTube, you were only 27. Time flies. Uh, no. I was younger than that. I was 20. Technically, I think my first YouTube video was uploaded when I was 25. And then I started regularly uploading when I was 26. I think. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I was 26. 26. 